Good evening, everybody. Thanks for tuning in once again. My name is Apollo, of course, and I'm here to try a couple more new things. Hope you guys have had a good week, and I'm back once again. This time, we got another limited edition of some kind, but this time it's everyone knows Hostess. Hostess has brand new mini donuts once again. Carrot cake mini donuts. I mean, come on. Now, you've seen these before, right? Of course. Yeah, remember, they're limited edition carrot cake miniature donuts from Hostess. You all know them about their Twinkies and stuff. Oops, it's a little messy. That's okay. It's not much of a smell to it. Hmm, not much really okay, but let's see if it tastes like carrot cake. I haven't tried much of carrot cake, but I am familiar with it. Hmm. Kinda like carrot cake. Kinda like it. Don't, don't mind the fact that there's a lot of crumbs here. It's a little messy <laughs> because you can kind of see. <laughs> but honestly, hmm, that's actually it's better than carrot cake personally. Um, carrot cake's okay. Over right here, kind of like that, but not really. It's kind of good though, to be perfectly honest. It's like a little sweet, little flavorful, but nothing overpowering. By any means, and that's good in my personal opinion. It's like a kind of a kind of a cakey donut, I guess, but with a different flavor to it. Number two, gotta drink this stuff down, right? Canada Dry has been around for since 1904, as a matter of fact. So if they come out with new stuff. They've always been known for well, we all know the classics back in the old days, but now they have a new one called the Fruit Splash Cherry Ginger Ale. I mean, you've seen that before, but I've never had that. I've had their classic stuff when I was growing up, but moving on forward. Fruit Splash, Cherry Ginger Ale. Okay. Hmm. Uh, let's try one more sip, but hmm. I can, I mean, I kind of taste the, the cherry a little bit, but it's just, it's like, it's kind of flat in a way, unfortunately. Like if they're trying to make it ginger ale-ish, but they're too much of the ginger ale-ish. You can't really taste the cherry or the fruit splash. You're mostly tasting that stuff on your tongue, lots of it, and it's kind of overpowering, unfortunately. I want to like it. It starts off, but it just... Too much of that ginger ale is too much of a taste, unfortunately. I wanted to like it. I really did. It's just a little flat for me, unfortunately, in terms of taste. Your mileage may vary. Either way, thank you for tuning in once again. I will see you when I have other stuff to try. Have a good night.